Hi everybody, Dave Yelovic with Homes Built Right. Kitchen Islands, this thing is big enough to almost land an airplane on. The electric code is finally catching up. Stay tuned, we'll talk about it in just a minute. Hi and welcome back. Uh, today we're in a house under construction and uh, we're using this Kitchen Island as an example of uh, what's coming up, uh, we're going to review over the next few videos the 2020 National Electric Code. Uh, we'll refer to it as the 2020 NEC. Um, but in years past, an island in a kitchen required one outlet according to the code. No matter how big it was, with a few exceptions, you had to have one outlet. On the 2020 uh, NEC, they've given us a little bit of a change. So what I've done is uh, we're using this and what has happened is they've given us a square foot formula. How many square feet of countertop do you have on your kitchen island? And that'll determine how many outlets you need. So I was here a little bit earlier. I measured this out in this direction in the depth. I've got four foot three inches. And then all the way across here in the length, this, this island is eight feet ten inches long. That's a big island. So if we add that up, that's just under 38 square feet of cooking of island countertop space here. So how many outlets will we need? Well, in the old days, one. But uh, in for a more modern or more modest island, if uh, let's say it's two foot by four foot or eight square feet, the code says up to nine square feet of countertop, you need one outlet. That's really about it. But this one now, so nine square feet is the base. So this one. We apply that nine square feet to our 38 square feet. We take that away, subtract that from that. It's gonna leave us 29 square feet. Then the new code says from there, every 18 square feet above that initial nine, you need an additional one outlet or 18 square feet and any additional. So we're gonna take that 29 square feet that's left over, divided by 18, and that's one point something. So it's one and some change. So if we round up, which is what the code says we need to do, we're going to have two additional outlets plus the one for the nine square feet. So we have three outlets. So the 2020 National Electric Code requires three outlets on this kitchen island, somewhere around the perimeter. Uh, there are some qualifications. You know, I can't have overhangs on the countertop and uh, try and put an outlet there and this and that. But uh, we're going to cover some more changes of the 2020 National Electric Code. So I urge you to tune in. Uh, on this one, tell us you liked the video, hit the like button, uh, subscribe to our channel, and join us next time as we do more Homes Built Right.